welcome to Argentina! Good morning guys, welcome to Adventure Friday. We are off to a place that we have never been before and we're off to a place that we have seen before. Come along with us. Coley, a little bit on the wobbly side. Every time we travel with Coley, she gets sick. She throws up maybe three or four times. So this time we gave her a little treatment that will help her with her car sickness, but I've never seen her so <laughs> right there that is a condor flying around. There's a bunch of them. I'm gonna change the lens and see if I can get a better view of it. Good morning guys. Welcome to the top of a random mountain. We are a few kilometers away from the Laguna Maule again. Uh, we learned on the way here that the pass to the Laguna and into Argentina is closed, so we can't go that far. We were hoping to go to a huge waterfall pass there, but as you can see, there's a lot of snow from this last weekend. We had lots of rain, and now we get to explore the Laguna in a different way. We were just here two weeks ago, and two weeks ago, there was hardly any snow. It was beautiful outside, just like today. And today, there's feet of snow all around us. We're gonna go check it out. Now because we are waiting for our permanent residency, we have to do as Chileans do and eat before we do anything. Pretty happy with our first stop. Good news guys, the pass is open. Let's go explore the Laguna. I don't know if you guys can see all of this with the camera that I've got on and the video and stuff, but the reflection, oh my goodness, check it out. That is straight up reflection. Mountain on the bottom, mountain on the top, bottom, top. Bottom top, bottom top. Maybe this reflection is even better. Check it out behind me, guys. This is amazing. Remember, we're on top of an active volcano right now. That is under the water. Unbelievable. Five hours later, and she's still not feeling good. Oh, poor Coley. And look how big this is. There is so much snow all around us. Look at that. Ah! All right, you guys, so Coley is down for the count. She can barely move. So we're not going to do any hiking today, but we are going to do more exploring with the car. So, check this view out. We're almost in Argentina. Welcome to Argentina. Headed down to the Laguna right now. 
it's definitely gotten a lot windier and I feel really, really cold all of a sudden. But we are at around 8,000 feet. So I guess that has something to do with it too. All right, Elise, what do you have? Show us all of the things, your treasures. They're my treasures. What are they? I don't know. But they're pretty. Volcanic rock. Yeah, they're volcanic rock. That's pretty Look cool. At this one. That's awesome. Good job, Elise. Thank you. I'm walking on snow. Walking on snow. The wind is coming in at about 120 knots. I don't know if we're going to survive. It's a little bit of a catastrophe, but I think it will be okay. Ari and Pudu just took off after a rabbit. Probably the first rabbit I've actually seen here in the wild in Chile. And they went way off that way. Really, really far. Coley, let me show you. Coley is sitting right there. Ari and Pudu went way up that mountain and then to the other side. Here comes Ari! Yeah! Just going for a little family walk. That's all. And they finally got their run in, chasing bunny rabbit. Elise and I's most likely favorite thing to do together is go to the mountains, go travel, go see something cool. But I think in third place, after Elise and I, comes all three of our dogs. They love running through the mountains. They're so happy here. Walking on some fresh powder. A lot of people ski, snowboard, take something cool down this like a sled. But we're just like the walking type, you know? Like good stretching the old legs. Left and right, left and right. Mm. Just nothing like it. Ladies and gentlemen, here comes Elise. Here she comes, here she comes, down the snow. She didn't even sink. I did, I wouldn't hear myself. Oh, that was smart. I think a lot. So guys, if you ever get a chance to come to the Malay region, and there's a fresh snowfall or a ton of rain that just happened, you have got to come out here to the Laguna. It is absolutely beautiful on every single side with the beautiful white snow. There's a reason that we came back uh, two weeks after we were just here, and it's because we wanted to see views like this. Isn't it incredible? So Lisa, on a scale of one to 10, how do you rate Laguna Maui? Oh, at 12. It's gorgeous. 12? If this was in the States, it would be a tourist zone. It's like a Crater Lake. Yeah, it is very similar to Crater Lake. We went there a couple of years ago, and it's a huge tourist spot, and there's tons of little hikes around it and things like that. But here, it is like a Crater Lake, because it is a volcano, an active volcano, and it's a lake on top of that. And it's beautiful with the water and you can go swimming in it in the summer. It is. So Coley's feeling a lot better. A lot, lot better. She's moving great. Walking on the snow. Doing the hike with us. Look at her go. Before she couldn't even move. Oh yeah, Ari got a bone. So have you ever had the feeling where you should have left a little earlier than you actually left and then the customs border closes at six o'clock in 30 minutes you've got to get back up this massive mountain to cross over back into Chile again yeah that's we can we can So close guys, so close. By guys, I mean dogs and the leaves. How pretty that is on the mountain. That is pretty. 
All right, so I don't know much about making car commercials, but I really feel like this spot has the potential for a great, great Kia morning car commercial. I don't know what the budget is like, but check it out. Kia morning, you done good. I think we're gonna make it, guys. I think we're gonna pass the border just in time. Another epic, epic day in the mountains. Really, you can't go wrong anywhere in the mountains in Chile. Just go east, and you're good no matter what. I feel like I'm in my heaven when I'm here. It is just so beautiful. And then you add on top of that all of the snow, which adds another dimension to the mountains. It was amazing. I loved it, every second of it. And then to have time with Elise and the dogs, perfect. See you guys next time for another adventure. Look how full our lays are now. Wow, thank you altitude. Oh. Nope, same amount of chips. <laughs>